you know you're in for a battle when you face him. I mean, he's leading the league in a lot of categories for a reason. And um, but we ran into a buzzsaw, and uh, but it was a good home stand. We win three series, go six and three, and very proud of the way these guys have played uh, over this last uh, three or four weeks. The effort, and the energy, and uh, playing smart, aggressive baseball. So I like to see that. Uh, Brad today, you know, just couldn't quite find his rhythm, couldn't find his tempo. And uh, the four walks coupled with those five hits put him in a little bit of a hole. And uh, we had a lot of fresh people in the bullpen. So we were able to get some guys work, um, you know, to go in and get them a little work down there. Um, Martin uh, had the double. Maddie had a tremendous day again behind the plate, which is just second nature for him, and uh, swung the bat with uh, two hits and a double there. So. You know, sometimes you just have to tip your hat, and uh, today was one of those days. Scherzer was on his A game and uh, executed pitches. I thought we squared up a lot of balls, uh, hit some balls hard that didn't find holes, and sometimes it's like that. Talk about uh, Urena a little bit today. I know you gave up the home run, but looked pretty good. Yeah, he did. You know, he uh, since he's come back, he's really been aggressive. Uh, his fastball. Probably the best fastball we've seen out of him. Uh, you know, after he come back off the DL, he's throwing the ball downhill, and um, he's got that good late sink life. And so when we brought him in, you know, we were looking. He got the ground ball back to him and got the out. Um, and he, he's a uh, he's a very aggressive kid. The way his demeanor is on the mound, the way he pitches, and that was good to see. Good to see him go into that situation and. Uh, and battle like that. What did you see on the, on the Harper Dietrich collision? What, what did you make of that? Uh, it looked like it looked like Dietz was going to cover the bag in case uh, Miggy wanted the force out, and then he continued to come across a little bit. Um, you know, he hasn't been there this year. We just we were looking for different places to keep him kind of in that utility mindset. And uh, as he come across the bag, I think Harper was looking at the ball, trying to go first to third, maybe on the throw, and they collided. Pretty, it's pretty good collision. I mean. And Dietz, you know, he gets hit by a pitch last night, uh, fouls a ball off his foot, has the collision today, so he, uh, he peed up a little bit. Um, DJ, um, I mean, today you've been officially eliminated, uh, not that there was any great suspense on it or anything, but just looking back now, I mean, is this something that's hard to, would have been hard to envision? A, when the season started, or you know, B, when you put the team together? Uh, certainly when we put it together in the beginning of, you know, spring training and the year, uh, we felt like this team, you know, with good health, that you had a chance to uh, contend. And as we've talked about many times, uh, it's been a trying year early for various reasons. Um, and, you know, today I know it took us to uh, official elimination, but I think at the same time, there have been a lot of positives over the last few months that uh, is going to make these guys much better uh, going forward. And I think that uh, some of the young players who are getting opportunities right now are making the most of that. But yeah, we didn't uh, we didn't envision it this way when uh, we were putting this ball club together back in November, December. Do you know much about the Decker kids, a local boy, a Fort Lauderdale? Did you guys, were you aware of him in your uh, scouting? Oh, we were, yeah. He's, uh, you know, we knew him. We see him a lot uh, during spring training and different stuff. We had seen him, and he's always, uh, you know, when he was over with the Mets, he's always been a guy that could swing the bat, and, and he put a good swing on that ball today. Went down and got that pitch and, uh, and shot it out of here. So, yeah, he's, uh, he's kind of that blue-collar baseball player.